So now, and competencies needed like the business analysis, the analytical thinking. Okay, that's fine. Elicitation is like an elicitation is like in digging the requirement. Elicitation means like in the questioning and finding the actual state of requirement. Is just moving deep down to the requirement and finding what exactly you are looking. At. That's all about the elicitation. While we talk about the elicitation, it's like the questioning and moving. Let's take an example. I'll give you the very wonderful example. Let's say uh, uh, the RCA, root cause analysis. While we follow the root cause analysis and, and, and while we come closely to the root cause, we always move with the bonefish structure. We, we just move into that. We define yes or no. If no, why not? If yes, then it's fine. Because we are done with the diagnosis. So diagnosis, in diagnosis, we do the elicitation. And, and we can, let's say, the requirement workshop, while we conduct a requirement workshop, we also do the elicitation. While we uh, 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 just point out to the focus group, focus group is a set of expert people, we also do the elicitation. We uh, come, uh, we put uh, SMEs into the picture, we follow the elicitation. So this is all about the digging the requirement. Elicitation means the digging the actual requirement, what exactly you are saying. Oh. Let's see, uh, if I put RFI into the picture, so while you seek for information, while vendor is seeking for information, so that comes into RFI. So seeking information is like, yeah, it's fine, you're finding information. So, so, so in the middle of that, if you're not done with it, if, you're not, uh, if your requirement is not validated, you will think that, no, I need to ask another more questions. I need to ask some other questions. I need to ask some extra questions to verify and validate. So while verify and validate, we also do we do also follow the elicitation activities. So that is all about elicitation. Elicitation is all about like the digging the requirements and finding the actual uh, uh, set of requirements. That's fine. I hope I could make it clear. Or do I need to elaborate more? That's cool. Fine. So, so like let's see uh, the competencies needed for the, if you don't have the competencies, it's very, it would be very tough to you know elicit the actual set of requirements. So let's see the competencies needed for the business analysis. The analytical thinking and the problem solving, that is very, very important. So analytical thinking is like, I mean, you will be thinking, you know, like, let's say, I, I give you some example, like, I'm Mishpik Bekasar in Delhi. So you just recently moved into the number, you identified, like, in what exact actual picture has to be there. So while we play with the number, while we play with some, uh, b b b b b b b while we put number into the complete flow, and while sometimes we do, you know, like the 15 project, man uh, that, uh, you know, 15 project managers are there, each project, each project man, and we allocated some cost. For each project manager, uh, uh, the one hour cost is $25. So while we do first kind of, while we do play with some data kind of, and, and just, you know, and while we do play and do some calculations, while we do some quant quantitative analysis, quantitative analysis, in, in that particular situation, and, and we just, you know, uh, we look to the number thing, we look to the analytical thing, we look to the, uh, you know, and then that's analytical stuff we can use in it. For the number, you can use for the number, you can use for anything. You can use for uh, the process diagram, you can use for the sequence diagram, you can use for uh, the organization modeling, you can use for anything. That's that's will be with the complete diagram. Now the behavior characteristic that has to be very flexible, very humble, and the BA should have the friendly nature. We should we should mix with every people. Uh, and that's okay, you know. And and, and in another way we say the BA is good friend of everyone. So when we talk about the BA and and, and you know and BA does involve closely to everyone and, 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 and a better way. So so behavior and characteristics has to be in a very in a better way. And the business knowledge and business knowledge is very, very important. Without business knowledge we cannot handle the whole whole situation. Knowledge management is also a part of you know, the business. I'll I'll, I'll share a part. Uh, there is a technique and that just normally be used. T I K W data information uh, uh, knowledge and, and wisdom. Uh, this is the, the actual flow of the analysis. Data has to be there. While we do the case study, we always uh, identify the data. And we always seek for the data. What data has to be? So data and I for information and information has to be there. If you don't have information, we go for the information. Let's see and I'm here. So let's say I put up some questions. So in the middle of that, you'll be listening more and more questions to validate the requirement, what requirement has to be there, and what the actual set of requirements uh, should align to figure out the actual details. So you'll be finding, fine, okay, 
Say, okay, how many sweet bakers in Delhi? So, what would be the location? So, do I need to put geography, all geography into the picture? So, no, I'll be saying, no, you need to find mm, uh, four and five geography into it. So, if you can find for four and five, so you can easily find for the whole country. You can take an average of four and five countries. Yeah. So, 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 four and five states. So, 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 accordingly, you'll be seeking for some data, and in the middle of that, I'll be answering to you that, yeah, these data are required, and these things are required, and you'll be finding, and you'll be, you need to figure out these kind of things. Then you identify even fine, and, and is there any kind of, what is the timeline to identify uh, the, the complete numbers? So I'll say no, within a day you have to identify. So, 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 so in, in, in each and every segment, and you will be following the agility. Agility means like, I mean, yeah, you'll be quickly finding, you'll be finding the timeline, you'll be finding the cost, and what cost you'll be giving, if I find the number and all, so what cost has to be there. So that's, that's, that's like a business need. So this is need and you are then, I mean, you identify the need and client is looking for uh, some number, some speed breaker numbers. So, so you will be moving in that way. So, so, so that, that has to be known, that knowledge has to be there. So you will be aligning your data, the, the information, and the knowledge has to be there. Without knowledge, it's very tough to, you know, connect the whole things and combine the whole things into the picture. So knowledge and, and the wisdom is very important. So the wisdom, I mean, uh, the wisdom is very, very important. So. Normally in, in India, we call it the wisdom comes after certain maturity. So, so, so that's I really appreciate because now the experience taught us the good things and experiences, uh, you know, give us the good information about the intelligence like, uh, yeah, I mean, we faced such kind of situation, we faced such kind of, 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 of hurdles, so, 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 say, so we not gonna face next time, so, so it's cool, fine, but, but, I really accept the fact the wisdom is very, very important. So while we uh, increase the experiences and everything, so uh, we get more and more information and we uh, make a, a clear understanding of our wisdom that what, and what actually the wisdom I should put to figure out the actual set of requirement. Interaction skills has to be there. You know, interaction skills comes into the underlying competencies. Um, and we should interact more and more with the customer and the client to figure out what exactly needs are there. So interaction skill is very, very important. The communication skills, that, that's very there. And communication is, 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 is like, you know, I mean, in terms of everything. Communication includes each and everything. It includes uh, the verbal communication, it includes the written communication, it includes the email communication, it includes everything. Video conferencing and everything. The software applications, it doesn't mean that you need to write and draw some certifications. It doesn't mean that you'll be writing some, uh, like, the tough software certifications and all. At least you should have an idea about the video and like some office tools like the Excel and the Word and the PowerPoint because that we always use the video for the process modeling and the and the sequence diagram for uh, the use case and scenario. If you know the UML token code, that's fine that you can go for that. That's, I mean, a lot of tools are there. So a lot of tools in the market. Like the Giphy, Giphy is also there for the process modeling and the flow diagram. And uh, Jira is like the debugging tool that we always use for debugging while we verify the requirements, validate the requirements. So, I mean, you know, the, it's, a, it's a bug tool. So, so, so these are the, I mean, the software applications that we need to acquire. So that, that's very, very important. So, 